Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What is the last stage of the public policy process? The public policy process consists of several stages. It begins with problem identification. This is followed by agenda setting, where the issue is prioritized. Next comes policy formulation, where solutions are developed. After that, the policy must be adopted through legislative or executive action. Implementation follows, where the policy is put into effect by government agencies. Done, but what happens after implementation? This is where the last stage comes into play. It is crucial to ensure policies are effective and achieving their goals. This stage involves assessing the policy's impact. It is known as policy evaluation. Gyanan policy evaluation is essential to understand the success or failure of a policy. It involves collecting data and analyzing results. Evaluators look at various metrics to determine effectiveness. They consider feedback from stakeholders and the public. The evaluation process can lead to policy revisions. If a policy is not working as intended, changes may be needed. This stage ensures continuous improvement of public policies. It also holds policymakers accountable. NAN evaluation helps in making informed decisions for future policies. It provides valuable insights for lawmakers and agencies. This stage closes the loop in the public policy process. It ensures policies serve the public interest effectively. N. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.